So we offer metal molding and we also offer urethane molding as well as something that's new for us, which is 3D printed molding. An aluminum mold is something that we use here to create custom parts with tight tolerances. An aluminum mold will typically last you years, tens of years. We still have molding from, you know, whenever we first opened this business uh, 50 years ago. Let's say you're making something for military and it's gonna be uh, utilized for 20, 30 years in the future and you wanna be locked into that specific design, a metal mold is definitely the way that you would wanna go. The cost associated can be a thousand to thousands of dollars, depending on what you're looking for. We started using 3D printed molding September or October 2021. 3D printed molds are more cost effective than aluminum in the short term. With 3D printing, you can print something, test it, go to the initial phases for things, and if you need to make adjustments, that can be done for roughly the same cost as the first mold, which would be in the hundreds to $8,000. Our capabilities have grown from just doing small two by two molds to being multi-cavity where it's two, 10, 25. There are a few factors that you should consider whenever you're comparing the multiple ways that we can mold custom parts here. The difference in cost from a aluminum mold to a 3D printed mold is stark. If you absolutely have to have it by a specific time to get your production line back and running again, that's something that's gonna take away uh, the option of using metal molding altogether. You're gonna wanna use something that's 3D printed, that's casted that way. Metal and 3D printed molding is gonna differ in the amount that you can cast in it. You're gonna be able to get anywhere from a single cavity to a 25 cavity, depending on the size in a 3D printed mold. Whereas in a metal mold, depending on the size, you can get anywhere from one to 100 out of a single uh, mold casting. Finished parts from a 3D cast mold is going to have a fine matte finish on it. I would say a take into machined parts, um, something you would see, see along those lines. Whereas a aluminum mold is going to have a very smooth surface finish. Machined in some places because that's unavoidable, but smooth for the most part. There is not a large difference in what you're gonna get from aluminum or 3D print casting, and that's actually a positive because at the end of the day, you can print something for a much lower cost as far as molding and then get the exact same part that you would out of an aluminum cast mold. A customer would come to us to have a 3D printed mold made for their part because of the 50 years of experience that we have with urethane itself and custom molding. The uh, amount of experience that we have on staff, custom making formulations and finding the right solution it is unparalleled. And our customer service is second to none.